Instructional video for 71008 Heavy Duty Programmable Sewing Machine. Hitech 71008 is one of the heaviest programmable bar tacking and pattern sewing machines for stitching very thick ropes and slings. In the manufacturing of climbing ropes, safety ropes, rescue ropes, height safety harness and personal protective equipment and military equipment. It is the best cell automatic sewing equipment widely used by rope and harness manufacturers in United States, Canada, Italy, France, UK, Belgium, Spain, Netherlands, Colombia, Argentina, Chile, Australia, India, South Africa, New Zealand, Fiji, Ukraine and Russia. This film made by David Miao. Step 1. Installation. Take out thread stand and install it. Find the operation panel, fix onto the table. Note a proper angle and position for convenient operation. <coughs> Step 2. Checking. Please check and adjust the needle position before turn on the sewing machine. Move the clamp by hand, forward, backward, right and left. Make sure the needle hole of needle plate is in the center of clamp, frame. Make sure that no stuff blocking the needle hole. Step 3. Turn on the machine. Connect to the air compressor. This is a switch that controls the air pressure. Push it to right to open it. This is the oil water separator. The value of oil water separator is 0.5 to 0.6 MPA. This is the air pressure regulator. The value of air pressure regulator is 0.3-0.4 MPA. Connect a power supply, 220-240V50-60HZ, one phase. Turn the switch to on. Green LED will light up. You will hear beep. The machine is turned on. Step 4. Selecting the pattern. This is operation panel. And this is pattern NO. The pattern code on operation panel will flash when you press this key. Press the key 4 and 6 to select the pattern number. Next press key speed. Then press key 4 and 6 to adjust the speed of the sewing pattern. The real value depends on the thickness of the material. The sewing speed must be slower for thicker material. The sewing speed should be set between 200 RPM 600 RPM, depend on the thickness of your material. After the speed adjusted, press enter key to confirm. The clamp will automatically move to the origin position of the pattern. Step 5, Adjusting. 
1. Adjust the position of the rope and clamp. First adjust the air pressure to be 0.1-0.15 MPA. Then load the rope to clamp, sewing frame. Adjust the pressure of the clamp. Loosen the screw on the limitation ring. Push the limitation ring to the direction of the cylinder by hand. Make sure no gap between the limitation and cylinder, then tight the screw. Use same way to adjust the limitation ring on the other side of rope. Then adjust the air pressure regulator to normal value again, 0.3-0.4 MPA. Make sure the clamp fix rope tightly, but not very tight, you should be able to move the rope right and left slightly. If the clamp is too tight, rope will become very hard, then reduce the stitch quality. 2. Set the pattern center. Press F1 key, Pattern Center. Enter Pattern Center. At this time, the needle position is just the center of sewing pattern. Press 8 and 2 key, the clamp will move forward and backward on the Y axis. Make the needle in the middle of the two ropes. Press 4 and 6 key again, the clamp will move on the x-axis. Usually we set needle position to the center of the material, left-right symmetry. If you have special sewing requirement, you can adjust the pattern center to left or right. But the pattern sewing center must within sewing frame, clamp. Press the enter key to confirm. The clamp will automatically move to the origin position of pattern. 3. Adjust the presser foot height. Pedal right and left foot switch to take the rope out. Make the left rope be closed to above of clamp. Pedal the right foot switch to down frame. Press the thread key, the presser foot go down. Turn the handwheel clockwise to make the needle at the lowest position. Loosen the screw, adjust the presser foot height. 2 to 3 millimeters below the surface of the material, special material may be required different setting. At same time, make sure the needle be the middle of the presser foot hole. Then, tight the screw. Step 6, trial sewing. Press thread key, pedal the right foot switch. Take the material away. Then to make trial sewing for testing machine. Press forward key, machine will enter trial sewing mode. In this status, press forward and forward key. The machine will move one step forward or backward. Press on the forward key. The machine will finish whole pattern under the trial sewing mode. During trial sewing, we make sure the needle always move within frame slash clamp. And make sure the machine runs smoothly, no abnormal noise. Otherwise, please readjust the machine before start your production. Press CL key to exit trial sewing mode. Press enter key to confirm. Machine will be back to sewing start point. Step 7, thread, wind thread, install the bobbing thread. Put bottom thread on thread stand.
Take bobbin out after threading. Wind bottom thread on bobbin. The small dowel pin must insert to the small hole on bobbin. Pull the bobbin holder to fix the bobbin. Press wind key. Machine will enter winding thread mode. Pedal the middle foot switch start. Machine start to wind thread. The bobbin holder will be sprung out while bobbin is full. Pedal the middle foot switch start, thread winding stops. Press win key, machine will exit thread winding mode. Take bobbin out. Open shuttle hook. Install bobbin. Trim the excess thread, the thread tail should be 5 to 6 centimeters. Then put the upper thread on thread stand. Thread sewing machine as we are showing in video. Press threading key, turn the hand wheel in clockwise direction. Down needle to low position that convenient for threading. Now turn the hand wheel to lift the needle. After threading, the excess thread, the thread tail should be 5 to 6 centimeters. Step 8, Sewing. Load the rope in the clamp. Pedal the left foot switch to close the clamp. Pedal the right foot switch to down the frame. 
Adjust the direction of the needle cooler, make sure the nozzle focus on the needle. Turn the air pressure regulator, it can adjust the blowing pressure. Pedal the middle foot switch, the machine start to sew. After first sewing, check the thread tension of bottom sides. Make sure no skip stitch, bobbin thread knots, tangles and other stitching defects. First and second sewing quality is poor, the third sewing quality is perfect. If you have any additional question or contact our engineer at info at automatic-sewing.com. Thank you for your time.